Hello YouTube, we were shooting here. We were originally going to be trout fishing at the Mount Bellevue City Park Pond, but it was extremely tough. There was a lot of people there. And Alex already caught, how many did you catch over here? Uh, nine or so? Nine bass in like two hours, right? Two and a half. Two and a half hours. Hard to get to spots all around this bank. A lot of thorns, a lot of wood, grass. Alex cleared up some spots here though, and he's catching them. You got to cast right to the center. That's where the deeper part is. All along the bank, it's pretty shallow with the grass. You guys stay tuned. Come on, bass. All on Texas rig. I got 12 reps today. I got 21 fish out of here already. Well, some are the same ones. What? Like new bearings and uh, drive clutch. Uh uh. Yeah. Just clean it up. Because my drag is like almost tight all the way. Yeah. And it flips on one ponder. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, it's pulling hard, bro. There he is. <laughs> Nice. All right, Alex put me on a fish. <laughs> Look at that. Dude, that's a nice one. That looks like a three. Dude, he has a red eye. They're spawning. Oh, no way. Look at that, you guys. Hooked on the side of the mouth. That eye looks red or orange. Brown-eyed bass, so. A what? Brown-eyed bass. Brown-eyed bass. Pop that right out. Dude, now I gotta go all the way up there for the scale. That's a nice one. <laughs> all right, got rid of the skunk. Let me see if I can go to the scale now. This is gonna be tricky. While holding the fish. Walking through the thorns. going for a little trip bass I like barely felt the bite and I was like oh they're hitting this thing he went like boom all the weight out of him How much you think it weighs? Uh, I'd, I'd say it's pushing three. Three, three, two. Uh, All right. Point, uh, 15. Let's see. What? It's not even a three. Two pounds, eight ounces. Huh. It's 30 though. Yeah, that's a nice one. It's kind of thick. Let me zero out the scale. We'll check it again. Oh man, it turned off. <laughs> All right, we're zeroed. How much did I say earlier? Now it says two pounds, five ounces. I think I had said two six. Close enough. Nice one. I'm gonna get a quick picture and throw them back in. First fish of the day, a two pounder. Let's see, just give him a toss. Did you see my four? There he goes. All right, you guys, there's that lure. Looks like we can still fish it. 
I do not know the color of that worm though. It's a Berkeley Max Scent. Kind of like a Senko style worm. The bass wanted it. I thought it was a three. <laughs> Man, I should have brought some of my new lures today. I left them at the house. Come on, bass. There we go. <laughs> he felt bigger, but I could see his mouth. It's not that big. Dude, they're biting pretty good here, Alex. Nice. Look, it also has those color eyes. This one's definitely shorter. Ooh. He's active. He's active. He's trying to close his mouth. It's about a pound. Pound something. Very cold bass. Look, he's trying to close his mouth on my finger. Come on, man. Bass number two. Let's let him back in. There he goes. They take off quick. All right, you guys. Let's try throwing around this little 3 8 ounce, 6 cents hybrid jig. I forget the color. I think it's Cajun Crawl. Or it's a bluegill pattern. I'll put it in the description. But anyways, that's a 3 8 ounce, 6 cents hybrid jig. And I have a Strike King. Rage tail, their little crawl is like a green pumpkin crawl. That's a trailer. Let's see if they'll bite this. I have a pretty good feeling they will. Hopefully they like that crawl. Maybe swimming it or dragging the bottom with it. We could also do the yo-yo. Come on, bass. Go for that crawl. There we go. We got one on the jig. Yes. I can barely feel the bite. He's swimming with it. He's swimming with it. He's right here to my left. He's taking off. He's taking off. Nice. Fish number three. He wanted that jig, you guys. Popped that right out of him. Hooked on top of the mouth. Nice. I really like that jig. Way out there. I barely felt the weight on it. I think he bit on the landing. Bass number three. Let's throw him back in. Oh, there he goes. Let's get back to fishing. All right, you guys. That's going to be all for today's video. Overall, it was a pretty good day of fishing. Pretty fun out here. Alex destroyed him. He caught a bunch. He's down there fishing. I believe he's at 15 bass now, and he's still going. I caught three two of them were on this power bait i believe it's called the general it's a five inch sanko style lure there you can see it's already broken a little bit i don't know that color though and i caught one on this jig right here the six cents hybrid jig with that little strike king rage crawl as a trailer and the reason i couldn't keep catching them man i had such a bad backlash you guys i had to keep cutting and cutting and cutting I'm gonna have to fix this and normally I have an extra spool of line in this front pocket up here but I forgot I took it out last time I was at the house organizing tackle didn't put one back in there and I needed to because you never know when you're gonna have a bad backlash and you have to re-spool but anyways not too bad we didn't catch any trout but we will have to try that again for sure either there at evergreen and we'll definitely be back out here at this pond again because Alex is getting a lot of numbers that's going to be all for today's video, you guys. Thanks for watching. Comment, rate, and subscribe.